Had John looked for his opponent's threat, he would have seen it quite quickly and played. Rook b88. When he probably would have won the game. However, John focused only on his own threats and ideas and tried to provoke White into advancing his g-pawn, so that he could put a knight on f5 with complete domination. The punishment was swift and brutal. Bishop c6 d7. Queen d2 e3. Number. We now see that white wants to play f4 f5 to activate his bishop and maybe improve things with f5 f6 plus next. This is possible because of the threat down the e-file. Had black placed his rook on e8, ideas like this would not have worked. Necessary was. Knight d4 f5. g4 takes on f5. Knight e7 captures f5. Queen e3 f3. Bishop d7 c6. When black has some compensation for the peace and practical chances, to swindle. Bishop d7 captures g4. This is rubbish but John is in trouble anyway. f4 f5 Knight e7 takes on f5 The text is good enough, but even stronger was. Bishop g3 captures d6. Knight f5 captures e3. Bishop d6 e5. King g7 f8. Rook e1 takes on e3. And black is losing everything. Bishop 
Bishop G3 E5 F7 F6 Bishop E5 captures D6 Knight F5 captures E3 Rook E1 takes on E3 Knight D4 F5 Rook F1 takes on F5 Bishop G4 captures F5 Bishop D6 captures B8 D5 D4 Rook E3 E7 King G7 H6 Bishop B8 F4 G6 G5 Bishop F4 D2 D4 captures C3 Bishop D2 takes on C3 Beauty equals 10.9